Hello everyone and welcome to a game I teased way back when called Secure Wars for the PS2. I have never played this game. This will be completely new to me. Because there's no load game option as you can tell. So it will be very interesting. So with that let's get right into it shall we? I uh, look looks awesome. Like I love the, what, the style so far. So far. I may regret it completely when I finally start, but well, let's get into it, shall we? There are voices. Mother, here I am, in the Imperial capital of Tokyo. They're not good voices. And tomorrow, my new life in the city will finally begin. <laughs> Are you Miss? Nice to meet you, Taiga san. No, the pleasure is all mine. My name is Lieutenant Shinjiro Taiga. <laughs> Okay. Wow, so that's Sakura Shinjuki from the famous Imperial Assault Force, huh? Shinguji, sorry, not Shinjuki. Lieutenant Taiga, please follow me to our secret base beneath the Grand Imperial Theater. Lieutenant Taiga is not worthy of a voice, apparently. Only in cutscenes. Theater? The main headquarters for our global defense force is under a stage? That voice sounds so familiar. First, it's the perfect cover for our clandestine operations. And second, we quell the evil within the hearts of all citizens through the magic of song and dance. Sure you do. Sure you do. We, the Flower Division, combat injustice and defend the peace of this great city. Well, with a name like Flower Division, I don't really know what I expected, but that's probably... Probably about right. But we also use the power of the theater to maintain general order. These are our duties. That sounds amazing! And I'm a member too now, right? <laughs> Good luck, Lieutenant Taiga. Commander Ogami expects much from you. If I'm not mistaken, you're his nephew, are you not? Can I pause this? Discontinue. <sighs> There's no way to like change the volume settings. Discontinue. Sorry guys, we're not playing this game anymore. I've discontinued it. I am. He's my mother's younger brother. He looked after me when I was a child. Well, it looks grand. So, you know, at least it's got that part of the name right. This is. Please come in. The commander has been waiting for you. I'm nervous. What should I expect? Ogami, may I present Lieutenant Shinjiro Taiga? Thank you, Miss Shinguji. Welcome, Lieutenant. It's an honor, sir. I haven't seen my uncle in years. Never like this. He makes me nervous. Your commander. Uh, of course. I have been assigned as a full member of the Imperial Assault Force as of noon today. Oh, oh. I have to actually hurry up and make my choices. Lieutenant Taiga reporting for duty, sir. Good boy. Now straighten that back and give it everything you've got, okay? Yes, sir. That's it. I didn't need to say that. He already did it for me. Oh, and one other thing, Lieutenant. There's something you should know. You haven't actually been assigned to the Imperial Assault Force. What? She lied to me. 
Oh, you don't say. Wait, what? Lieutenant Tiger, as of now, you are assigned to the Star Division of the New York Combat Review. Hmm. I don't know. That sounds pretty cool. As, uh, as if I have a choice in the matter. <laughs> New York? Now, hold on. I don't want to go to New York. Everyone's all mean and uppity. It's our newest branch, right behind the Paris Assault Force. Right. What are we assaulting exactly? Was it, this was not explained in the in the notes. I didn't get that memo. I think you'll be of great assistance to them. I recommended you personally. Well, I mean, if you think I can do it, then you know. I should at least give it a shot, right? They're all a little green over there, so I want you to take a leadership role with them. What? But, but. You're what? 19 years old now? You shouldn't be afraid of a little international travel. Well, I shouldn't, but I am. Don't worry. I was nervous when I first went to Paris, and look at me now. I'm a commander. I'll get in touch with a few friends in New York. They can help you if you have any trouble. All right. Please tell me. Please tell me everyone in New York has an accent. That would be amazing. I, I see. Um. Th thank you, sir. The peace of New York rests on your shoulders. Oh shit. Good luck. Well, I hope you all enjoy New York while it lasts. Don't think it's gonna be around for too much longer. Oh, I'm on a boat. That's cool. What the hell am I wearing? What's in this box? That's not a box. It's a bag. If you ever isn't find it? yourself in a tight spot, use this. What is Until it? That time what comes, is it? Just make sure you keep it safe. What is it? Okay. One more thing. Tell me what it is. No matter what enemies you come across, just believe in yourself. Your time has come, Damn Lieutenant man. Shinjiro. Stop being so cheesy. Hard. I wish you the best of luck. Thank you very much, Uncle. I'll do my best. Man, how old is that uncle? <laughs> Look, everyone, it's the Statue of Liberty. It's amazing. It's a symbol of freedom and prosperity. We gotta get our, our thingy stamped. Buildings, they're so big. What the hell? Oh, they're like blimps. Stoplights. What year is this? This is America. This is New York City. This is the place that I've sworn to protect with my very life. All right! Where there's a will, there's a way. The New York Combat Review is waiting for me. I'll make everyone proud. I'm gonna show them all my samurai spirit. What the hell's wrong with his ears? Chapter one: Samurai makes his first stand. Welcome to the Big Apple. Why do they call it the Big Apple? I mean, what does that even mean? Wow, everything's so big. The buildings, the cars, even the people. Yeah, what is that? Look at them. They all look so different. Their skin, their eyes, and hair. It truly is a melting pot. But it looks like whoever was supposed to pick me up is running late. Thief! Thief? In the middle of the day? Can't just stand by and watch. I have to go after him. Do we really have to? Do we Stop have to? Right there, villains. Come on. Get away. Who does the bag with a dollar sign on it? What the fuck? A samurai sword. Well, this is probably the coolest thing I'll see all day. Don't worry, they're still alive. What? Money! Thank you. Hold on! 
Um, excuse me. Uh, what's your name? I do not like having to be pressured to make choices. It's kind of annoying. My name is the sound of rain on the dusty hard path. In other words, I'm not terrible. Hmm. Does anyone have a dusty hard pan and some water? What the hell is a dusty hard pan? You're a samurai, aren't you? Then I'm sure you can handle a few no good mongrels, right? What the hell are you wearing on your face? Are those like glasses or is that like a um, weird costume or, or what? What's going on? So long, amigo. Wait, I have so many questions, and you've answered none of them. <laughs> what was all that? Who the heck was that masked woman? <laughs> well, what's she doing with that crazy horse? The fuck? <laughs> this game is fucking weird. Okay, so what about the sack of money? Should I just leave it here? Oh, looks like I don't get to take it. Oh, are we gonna get arrested now? Damn, we're too late. How come she always gets away so fast? Hmm? Hey, boy, where'd you get that? Uh, it's not what you think. For bank robbery and blind stupidity. Don't you know where you are? Um. What? I didn't steal anything. A mass woman always gave it to me. Ah, oh, who's stupid? Yeah, yeah. Tell it to the judge. Kid. Now get in the car. Wait, I'm innocent. I tell you, innocent. This is an outrage. Welcome to America. Why is everyone so like ridiculously outlandish? He's not even playing nice that. Nice to meet you, Shinjiro. I'm the mysterious merchant, Kayama Yuichi. Okay. Ah, I see a mysterious merchant. I thought we were getting arrested. What happened? Did I skip some chapters? Oh, hello, detective. Uh, have you met my good buddy here? I don't know why your mouth moves sometimes and not the others. You're like an amazing ventriloquist, sir. Please tell me your secrets. Damn it, guy. Oh, okay. This guy's a criminal. You can't protect him. Thanks for helping me. Uh, Kayama, was it? Think nothing of it. It was my duty to find you and guide you safe. Oh, it's that guy. Who's supposed to meet me? Where the fuck were you, man? Really? So you're one of my uh, friends my uncle mentioned? Such a bright lad! Now please, step into my automobile. Are you like mocking me or something? I don't say kindly to your tone, good sir. Shall we have a duel here in the street? Little Lip Theater. That's not conspicuous at all. This is the Little Lip Theater, our little home away from home. Consider this your new office. So, does that mean you guys quell evil through the magic of song and dance, you know, just like in Japan? I'll give you partial credit. That's only one piece of the cherry pie, so to speak. But yeah, People from all kinds of backgrounds come here to have fun. It's the perfect New York. As opposed to an imperfect New York? The perfect New York. That sounds amazing! Hey, Kayama. My, my, who's this lovely beauty? Thanks for bringing back the new guy. Traffic must have been a pain, huh? So... Who's the kid? Oh, Marshari, it is I. This is Lieutenant Shinjiro Taiga, 
who comes highly recommended by our commander Ogami himself. Highly recommended. Oh, seriously? But I thought they were sending... Um, Koyama? Who is this? Oh, sorry. I'm Ratchet Altair, captain of the New York Combat Review, Star Division. Okay. R really? What? You're surprised? Is it because I'm a woman or something? I'm not sexist. That's what you mean. Uh, I didn't expect such beauty. Yeah, we're gonna flirt. Lieutenant Tiger, that is not the right word to describe your direct superior. Oh, if it's not right, then I hate being wrong. Besides, a woman is more than her appearance. But I'll let it slide just this once. Yes, of course, ma'am. My apologies, Captain. Alright. I really need to get going. Where are you going? Take good care of the kid. Hey, Captain? Of course. Thanks again, Kayama. If you're ever in trouble, I'll be here then come on down to Romando. My shop. I'm there every Romando, day. Romando, man. That's such a good name for a shop. Romando. This actually sounds like a really good place to name for like a restaurant. Let's go to Romando. Be awesome. I appreciate Kayama. See you later. Don't get in any trouble now, Shinjiro. Oh, this guy's about as eccentric as it gets. What's with that weird? Ah. Uh, office is on the top floor and we have some things to discuss oh we do indeed have some things to discuss remember we're in a public place lots of civilians don't call me captain here yes captain I mean I mean yes ma'am sorry captain I, I mean miss Altair miss Altair sounds like there's supposed to be like a pun in there somewhere but I'm, I'm missing it how clever. I didn't know you could grow a garden on a skyscraper. <laughs> yeah, the commander is unique. That over there is his office. Man, the commander's gonna be awesome, isn't he? Please be awesome. Excuse me, sir. The recruit from the Imperial Assault Force has just arrived. What flag that is. Pleased to meet you, Commander. My name is Shinjiro Taiga. I look forward to serving you. Ah, Konbanwa, uh, Konnichiwa, and Ohio. <laughs> Don't quit your J job, buddy. Um. This is Mr. Sunnyside, your commander and owner of the Little Lip Theater. Mr. Sunnyside, that's the best you could do? Oh, well. That guy's evil. I, I don't know. I have a feeling he's gonna like turn on us at some point in the game. I don't know. Could be completely Welcome wrong. To the team, Shinjiro. May I call you Shin? No, you As may not. As said, I am Commander Sunnyside. Commander Sunnyside up. Oh. No. But everyone affectionately refers to me simply as Sunny. What's that, Sunny? Actually, we don't. Burn? <laughs> Serious as always, but of course that is one of your many charms. This guy is pretty weird. <laughs> Man, did you not look around when you got here? Everyone is weird. It's like, hey, we're gonna take this guy to America. We're gonna like make everyone ridiculously eccentric and weird and goofy as possible. you'll do your best to help out the team of course sir I this is my chance to prove my dedication I don't know what this means oh oh I'll try to help out ever I can that is if you need it and I'm not a bother Lieutenant Tiger, speak up 
talk with clarity and volume. Assert yourself. That was bad. I heard that noise. That was not a good noise. Game over. Restart. We'll cut him some slack. In Japan, directness like that could be considered rude, you know. I think that's actually true. I interpreted his statement as I'll fulfill my duty, even at the cost of my own life. Oh, um, but I did not say that, sir. Or imply that in any way. See? Is that not a reasonable assumption to make? Not really. So you only meant exactly what you said? Yeah, I know, isn't that strange? Uh, well, well, no, I'll definitely do my duty, even if I must risk my life. Way to backpedal, buddy. Well, that's just awesome. Can't wait to see you in action. Me either. Yes, sir. Very good. Now just go to the address listed on this piece of paper. We've arranged an apartment for you in the village. You can take your things there right away. Uh, thank you very much. I should get going then. By the way, Shinster. Um, Shinster? Are you familiar with the uh, Harakiri? I've heard of it. You mean ritualistic suicide? Bingo! Now I don't want you to think that Harakiri is a viable option here, understand? That's the quick way out. Here in America, you are expected to live with your mistakes. Man, you cannot tell me when I can and cannot commit suicide. Like, seriously, dude? Y yes, sir. That's all. Sayonara! Dude, just speak English, man. You're embarrassing yourself. Well, that was an interesting first day. I should just save. Take my memory card. Save the data. Okay. Well. I think with this, I'm gonna cut the video here. Um, so I will see you all in part two. So take it easy guys.